Yo, what's up coders? Welcome back to Code with Lhasa. Today we're testing six of the best AI coding tools to see which one is the best for coding. Here's the plan. I'll introduce each AI tool. I'll enter the same coding prompt. We'll copy the result into VS Code and test it. Which AI will win? Let's find out. Before we start, don't forget to like, subscribe, and let's go. GitHub Copilot. All right, let's start with GitHub Copilot. This is built into VS Code and works like an AI pair programmer. It suggests code while you type. If it works well, it could save a lot of time. I already have Copilot set up, so let's test it. Now, I enter my prompt. Okay, Copilot is thinking. Let's give it a second. All right, got the result. Now, I'll copy the code, paste it into VS Code, and run it. Wow! This is actually a complete and structured web page. It even included some basic styles. Copilot is off to a strong start, but let's see if the next AI can do better. Claude AI. Next up, we have Claude AI by Anthropic. Now, Claude is known for being great at explaining code, but how well does it actually generate code? Let's find out. I enter my prompt. All right, Claude is working. And there we go. Let's copy and paste this into VS Code and run it. Hmm, interesting. The code works, but Claude also added a detailed explanation of each part, which is actually useful for beginners. But was the output better than Copilot? Not really. It's good. But I was hoping for more structure. Let's move on to the next. Poe AI. Now let's check out Poe AI by Quora. This one is interesting because it lets you choose between multiple AI models, but we'll use its default AI for this test. All right, same process. I enter my prompt. Okay, let's see what Poe gives us. There we go. I'll copy the result, drop it into VS Code, and run it. Hmm, this one is pretty basic. The structure is there, but it didn't include much styling or interactivity. It works, but it feels a bit rushed. So far, Copilot is leading. Let's check out Codium next. Codium. All right, now we have Codium. This one is known as a free alternative to GitHub Copilot, which means if it works well, it could be a game changer. Let's test it. I enter my prompt. All right, it's generating. Okay, done. Let's copy it, paste it into VS Code, and run it. Nice. This is actually better than Poe and Claude. It included some extra styles and even a bit of JavaScript interaction. Not bad for a free tool. DeepSeek AI. Now we're testing DeepSeek AI. This one is designed for complex programming tasks, so I'm curious to see how well it handles something simple like this. Let's enter the same prompt. It's thinking, and there we go. Time to copy the result, paste it into VS Code, and run it. Okay, this one is interesting. It actually structured the code really well, almost like a mini framework, but was it better than Copilot? Maybe for advanced users. ChatGPT. Finally, we're testing ChatGPT. This AI is already popular for coding, debugging, and explanations, but how well can it generate an actual project? Let's enter our prompt. All right, ChatGPT is thinking. The result looks detailed. Let's copy and paste it into VS Code and run it. Wow, this is probably the most complete version so far. ChatGPT even added comments and a proper structure. It's definitely one of the best in this test. So, which AI coding tool is the best? If I had to pick one for daily use, I'd probably go with GitHub Copilot or ChatGPT. But if you're looking for a free option, Codium is definitely worth trying. Which AI coding tool do you use the most? Drop a comment below. Want more AI coding videos? Smash that like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.